I'm Chris Gilson, editor of Steam Railway, and I'm here to welcome you to the Love Your Railway campaign, which we're involved with along with the North Yorkshire Moors Railway. The campaign runs between the 25th of July to the 4th of September, and to start with, we're going to present for you a series of video podcasts called Just a Ticket. These are on a series of themes, including history, our first theme, conservation, partnerships, family, volunteers, and education. We're looking for you to get involved in any way you can do, and especially on social media. So if you do want to contribute a film or something along those kind of lines, please use the Love Your Railway hashtag, whether it's on Twitter, Instagram, or on Facebook. We do hope you'll get involved and help us along our journey in celebrating Britain's preserved railways. Our first Just a Ticket video looks at history. I'd like to introduce you to Claire Wintermore from the Raymond Glass and Estelle Railway, a narrow gaze line that runs through the heart of Cumbria and is on some of the most picturesque track in Britain. Claire talks about why history is so important to them and also will introduce you to some of the engines that you'll see on the railway. My name is Claire Wintermoor and I'm the collections assistant here at the Raven Glass Railway Museum. And here history uh, is really important to us. Um, we love the railway that we're, um, that we're at and we think it's really important that people understand why the railway is here um, the, the reasons um, it came about. Um, we want people to engage with the history of our railway and local railways in general. Um, so we try and tell, tell the, the story um, of all of our local railways. Um, we like to engage with a, uh, a wide range of visitors if we can. Um, so we get, um, we get railway enthusiasts, um, who are really into all the detail and then we get families and, and young people um, and we try and get them to engage with different activities that you see around the museum here. Uh, so we have lots of different exhibits in the museum um, and some of our most popular ones are our locomotives that you can see here. Um, we've got Katie which is owned by the Preservation Society. We have St Alder here um, which um, St Alder uh, was built in 1912 and one of Sonoma's sister engines was actually one of the first that ran on our narrow gauge uh, railway. Um, Sonoma, some people may have seen that we've just had a big fundraising campaign as well for Sonoma. Um, it's been overhauled and we're just waiting for the last stage of that, which is her new tender. Uh, Little Giant here um, is one of the first miniature railways locomotives. Um, and again, it's, it's important to our story because it's one of the earliest of, the, of its type. Um, that basically inspired all the different um, engines that, that run on our types of railway today. Uh, we also have the various carriages um, and those are quite good because they bring back memories for different people in different age groups because they remember travelling in the different types of carriages um, so people can actually get in those and sit in them um, and have a bit of a reminisce if, if they like. Um, and we have um, lots of interactive things as well around the museum, um, including we have uh, River Esk's boiler, a former boiler from River Esk, uh, that children and adults actually really love because they can have a play with the regulator and the blow the whistle, um, and that's a, a really popular part of the museum. Thank you very much, Claire. That was a great look at the Ravenglass and Estelle. And if you'd like to contribute to the Love Your Railway campaign, please don't hesitate to email me and that's chris.gilson at bowermedia.co.uk and you can find that email address at the end of this video. Don't forget you can also contribute using social media but also remember to use the Love Your Railway hashtag when you do. Thank you very much.